First, let's talk about content. I'm sure you've all heard the word content before, but it would probably be difficult to explain exactly what it is, right? Before learning about copyright, let me first explain what content means. The English word content originally means the things that are in something. However, the word content that we are using today refers to anything that is created using text, images, or audio, and made available through various forms of media. Music, movies, books, and manga are all examples of this, right? But in the digital world, things like games, blog posts, social media posts, and YouTube videos are also forms of content. You have watched, read, and listened to all of these, haven't you? This sort of content is such a part of our lives that not a day goes by that we don't come into contact with it. The people and companies that make this content are called creators. In the same way that there are many types of content, there are also many types of creators. Music composers, film directors, writers, cartoonists, and game developers, as well as influencers who post information for their many followers on social media, and YouTubers who live stream videos. All of these are creators too. Quiz time! Are people the only ones who make content? What do you think? The correct answer is no. Some content is not made by people. In fact, some content is generated by artificial intelligence, or AI, or by programs instead of by people. There are even AI tools that can automatically create illustrations and images from simple prompts. If no people are involved at all though, then it's not a human creation and is therefore not considered copyrighted content. However, creators sometimes make use of AI tools to create original works, so it is very difficult to distinguish between the two.